Hi, this is Ed from CNC Explorer. And this video is going to talk about the feed rate displays. The feed rate displays really are the heart of the CNC Explorer app. These displays present the results of all your configuration selections. Um, it can be located on the top of the home screen in this section of blue, green, and red. And the top row shows the range of recommended feed rates as calculated from your milling tool selection, the material you want to cut, and the milling control selections. The second row um, calculates a plunge rate, which is 50% of the speed, I'm sorry, the feed rate recommendations. Now, our recommended feed rates are a little bit conservative. Um, and the green section is what we call the target selection. So that's a blend of an ideal feed rate for um, milling speed and tool life. If you get, if you want to be a little more aggressive, um, you can move into the red section, which is a maximum rate. Or if you're a little more conservative, um, the blue section. The difference is. The big technical is plus and minus a half uh, mil chip load on the calculations. Um, and it's also scaled for the, the type of machine you have, the rigidity, and your um, skill level all come into play on recommending a safe and conservative speed rate. For your CNC cuts. Um, also the displays can be shown in as shown here is in inches per minute in Imperial but if I go in my um, help not help with the profile settings I can select metric and all the units will be converted to millimeters per minute. So that should cover the feed rate display. Of course, we'll go over the, in future videos, the factors that go into the calculations. So for now, thank you very much, and thank you for listening.